So this is another video on being more minimalistic. Trying to reduce down all your belongings down to things and the only things that you need to live comfortably in a small space, tiny home, in my case an RV, even a truck camper. I have recipe books so today I have been going through my recipes and I have recipe books but I also created my own recipe my favorite or a binder is what I call it a recipe binder and this is all of my recipes that I've collected and I put them in uh, I just printed them off and put them in page protectors and then I separate of course these are ones that at times I forget to put them back where they came from but main dish I have dividers that's soups and so what I've been doing in reducing my paper and I think I've talked about that is about scanning all my documents into my laptop and onto an external drive so this is another area that I want to keep some of these and not all of them um, because you can find it back on the internet and not even print it but just use your tablet or your laptop to look up your recipes and I've been working on that and practicing that so I started going through these and the ones that I want to keep maybe I got the recipe off of a website then I'm going to that website and just copying the website or copying the recipe and putting it in Evernote so I, in an effort to go paperless, I am using Evernote as my um, collect all of every little piece of paper, all papers that I have. So that's a big uh, effort in itself. I used OneNote for a little while. I had issues syncing to all my different devices. So I started using Evernote and I have actually enjoyed Evernote better. It syncs really well with my iPhone, my iPad, my laptop, my work computer, everywhere. I put everything in it. I have one Evernote account. I put my work stuff in there and I put my personal stuff in there. So wherever I am, I have, you know, I can look at anything I want to at any time. So all I've been doing, I started this kind of this morning and I've already cleaned out all these page protectors. I already do the paper in the recycle bin and thought well I should probably do a, a, a video so this is one of my favorite recipes it comes from budgetbites.com which I told you already I use this website a lot for a bunch of my recipes I love it so this is onion fajitas so I will I'm just gonna go ahead and pull this one out and I'm gonna put it in a separate pile then when I have all the ones that I want to keep, I will get on the computer, go to the website, copy this link into my recipes. And I'm going to do a different video on Evernote. I'll have to figure out how to do the screen capture and do a video on that. And just show you how I have organized all of my notes in Evernote. But I'm going to work on this a little bit and... Um, I'm not going to bore you with going through each one of these, but I just wanted to kind of show you this is another another favorite, so I will put it off to the side. Of course, I added my notes here, and I'll have to do that on the Evernote. Chicken dumpling stew, never eaten that, so that one's going to go away. And then the one on the back, Roadtail Chicken Spaghetti. I like that one pretty good, so that one goes to the recycle bin this one is a written down recipe so i will just type it out in evernote and this one was a good recipe too so there's my chili recipe and i do like that one so i will and you could scan these um like this one is just hand typed and i could scan this and save it into evernote but 
it's not very long I'll probably do, probably just type it but this one no. so that's what I'm gonna do right now never had this so it doesn't get to stay either and that's all I'm gonna do the rest of the evening is I'm gonna go through here and segregate what I want to keep and then what I want to recycle and then I'll come back and do a video on how I use Evernote. So stay tuned for that. And I thank you for watching. Uh, if you like this video, hit a thumbs up. And also subscribe if you haven't already. Thanks.